let you gain new capabilities, increasing your advantage over normal men, giving you an added edge in killing monsters. To learn more, open the character portal. Okay, let's take a look. Uh, all right, okay. Can I see? Mutations. Press Y to open the mutations panel. To use mutations, first you must research them. To do this, choose one of the available mutations. All right. For mutation research to finish successfully, you must devote the required number of ability points and mutagens to it. Okay, choose one of the advanced mutations. Well, what have we got? Uh, to develop advanced mutations, you must first develop other more basic ones. Information about this can be found in the mutation description. Right, where are we? So we're on... What are we on? Deadly counter. Sword attacks deal 25% more damage to human opponents. Uh, immune oh, To human opponents immune to counterattacks and monsters. In all other cases, if the attacker's vitality is less than 25%, a counterattack immediately triggers a finisher. Useful. Signs can deal critical hits. Their critical hit chance and damage increase with sign intensity. Opponents killed by critical hits from signs explode. That sounds quite good fun. I haven't gone for a sign intensity build though, but that would be tempting. And perhaps see, now that the fight is over, I can safely tell you that you could have cheesed it even further with Golden Oriole. I could, yes. I've used that before. There was there was some... I think I've used it on these before, actually, because I was suffering with a bunch of... Not in this particular scene, but somewhere else with the uh, centipedes. But there was some monster that poisoned me really severely. And I can't remember what it was. Was it a boss fight? I know I used that, and it was basically... I was immune to everything, and it was great. Piercing Cold is your favourite? What's that one? That's magic sensibilities. Deadly counter. Toxic blood. Each time you're injured in melee combat, the attacking opponent receives damage in the amount of 1.5% of damage dealt for every point of your toxicity level. I can see why you might like that, Indigo. Euphoria. Each point of toxicity increases damage dealt by swords and signed by... quite a bit. Crossbow damage is now increased from naught to naught. <laughs> I guess it would display properly if my if I had a crossbow equipped, right? Crossbow critical hit chances and we're not going to do that. Let's not even look at it. Applying critical hits to opponents activates a random decoction for 120 seconds with no toxicity costs. The maximum number of decoctions that can be activated simultaneously by the mutation is three. Witcher sensors help you see better in dark places. Well, that might be nice. Bloodbath. Each fatal blow dealt by a sword dismembers the enemy or activates a finisher. Each fatal blow dealt by a sword dismembers the enemy. I guess it'll look pretty nice. Each blow dealt by a weapon in melee combat increases attack power until combat ends. Bonus is lost if you take damage. Ah, if you take damage, there's my, there's my weakness. Piercing cold is in the left path. There are two cool ones that more that you like. Let's see what we've got. Adrenaline rush. Piercing cold. When the art sign is cast, it additionally has a 25% chance of freezing opponents. Opponents knocked down and frozen simultaneously die immediately. Opponents who are not frozen are dealt an additional 1,911 damage. That's pretty good. Uh, what's this? When drawn, magic, unique, and witcher swords increase sign damage dealt by 50% of their own. Right, okay. So that's really good for a sign build. Adrenaline rush. At the start of combat, sword attack power and sign intensity increase for 30 seconds by 30% for each foe after the first. So in fighting 11 foes, the bonus is 300%. Once it wears off, sword attack power and sign intensity drop by 10% for each participating foe after the first. Complicated. When vitality reaches zero, you become temporarily invulnerable and regenerate 100% vitality. It's effective uh, once every three minutes. Okay, and what's that? Strength and synapses improved by research and mutations. Each stage unlocks an additional ability slot. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, well, what do we do? How do we research this? I need three ability points and two greater red mutagens. Deadly counter. Well, I want that, I think. Mutation has been researched. Only one mutation can be active at any given time. And so we... Okay. Um, continue. A strength and synapses mutation improves automatically when you develop other mutations. As it does, it unlocks additional bit. Oh, right. Okay, cool. I need more ability points. Because that one, that one looks pretty cool up there. 
Adrenaline Rush is your second one that you like. Second life. Cool ability once it triggers. Second life looks pretty badass. Okay. Um, where we go get some more ability points? Or I could respec. Uh, we'll see See how we go. I'm not too interested. Well, the sign ones are pretty good. The sign ones look awesome, actually. That looks rubbish. And we're not... Each, each adrenaline point decreases damage received. Oh, uh, that's quite good. But it's a long way around to get it. Hmm. Curious. I could fancy those two, I must admit. I don't use signs really enough and add really enough to make use of it. But... To see what mutation is currently active, open the mutation panel. Strength and synapse yeah, improves automatically. Okay, okay, so we've got... Oh, nice, we're going to get these as well. Nice. Now, that's good. That really is good. Uh, it's almost worth respecking for right now. Hmm. Should we do it? You also think you'll like Adrenaline Rush once you try it? You only have one active at a time, can't you? So let's go and use this for a bit and see what it does. Also, let's get dressed before we go and find something to kill us. Uh, let's go back to my Witcher stuff and that nice crossbow there. And that, and my... Actually, my weight isn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. That's everything re-equipped. About time we got some Grandmaster armor built up, I think. Where's this telling me to go? Leave the laboratory. Can I just leave... Hmm. A power cell for portals. Feels dead. Maybe a sign will revive it. Let's give it some art. Whoosh. Nope. Igni? When Yudin Axi? Was there a symbol of this on it, by the way? I didn't think that would work. Oh, should I be shooting at that? Right, hang on. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was. I thought I was using the right one to start with. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's get out of here. Did he just do a somersault? Did he just... Yes, okay, that's cool. I didn't know you could do that. Whenever I do that in a swimming pool, I just end up with ears and nose full of water. I, see, I seem to be trapped under the surface here. There, no, that's better. Oh, well, that's nice. It's definitely going to be worth um, researching some more of those mutations just to unlock the extra ability points, if nothing else. Where have we got to go? What we're going to do, I've got a boat, so I'm going to go and sort that one out first. Light the torch. The torch band. You're talking about that thing that was, like, suspended... The thing that I eventually used Ard on. I can't say used Ard on without it sounding like I've got an erection. Right, somewhere up here. See if I can trash the boat as we land. Is that a massive blood stain on there? It looks like it. Oh, cool. We've got a secret cavern and some... Oh, it's blood moss. Okay. It's just so you can see the crystal. Uh, I walked past that crystal earlier. So, what are we doing? We're going down? Whoa, whoa, is this... Oh, it's straight down. Okay. I wasn't quite expecting that. Down we go. What's that? Diamond rings, skulls. Is this going to be something I should probably take all that? 
Uh, let's just take a killer whale potion if it's not too late. That one. Does that help? I don't know if that helps once you're actually down, does it? Take all that stuff out. I might be swimming back up. Is there any air in here? Yeah, I think there is, is there? This looks like there is. Have I got this wrong? Shit. <laughs> what the hell? Hang on. No. <laughs> okay. Down we go. We're gonna... Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> I swum into something I shouldn't have done. I've noticed a couple of odd... Can I get out of this? This is not a nice way to go, by the way. <laughs> yeah. You choke, Geralt. I don't think I'm getting... What? <laughs> well, I didn't expect that to work. Out of map. The game clearly took pity on me. Let's go and try this again. I should have a better health bar this time. <laughs> That's worthy of a clip. It is. I should put a stream marker on this. Right, let's try this again. Hate steering underwater. Absolutely hate it. Just t <laughs> turn round and let's start that again. Right. <laughs> Going in. I wonder if it's because I'm using the controller and I wonder if using a, a mouse and keyboard would be much easier for these underwater sections. So there's something on that guy there. Is that it? Did I come down here again for nothing? I was kind of expecting to see... Where's that locked treasure? Oh, that locked treasure's above me, okay. So I don't need to come down here. Did I not get that? There's this thing over here, is this... Did I not get this? Oh, was this locked? It's not there. It's further up, actually. Can I get... Ah, I see. Escape Artist Journal. Was that it? Part of the journal is sticky with dried blood. 22nd day of the month of Burke. The worst part of my work is not that I have to crawl through cesspits, jump from great heights, dive into canals... Be tied up, untied, lash, burn, tortured, have my fingernails ripped out, or scraped off while digging tunnels barehanded. No, none of that's the worst. The worst is that I've got a document at all and hide the notes from the guards. Each escape must be noted down in detail, otherwise my employers won't have a basis for releasing my pay. The work of a professional escapologist is not easy, my friend. Is this guy supposed to be like the equivalent of Sly Stallone in that, um, that film he was in with Arnold Schwarzenegger where they're in prison? He's a professional prison prisonologist or something who tries to escape. You think you took a key to open treasure somewhere else? Maybe I didn't activate that. This is what I was looking for anyway. This, I thought it was down there, but it, it's, it's not. Uh, that's a lot of a diary that I can't be bothered to read. Scopology, track the quest. Unless there was another quest nearby for that key, was there? You are joking. Find the sunken ruins and the elven treasure. I don't want to go straight back there. Okay. I guess we will. What was that film? What's that film I'm thinking of then? It's got Sly Stallone in. He's a professional prison... Um, I don't know what you call him. Prisonologist. He basically goes around prisons and noting how easy it is to escape them. He puts himself in as a... or he gets himself in as a prisoner and then sees how quickly he can escape. So he can advise the governors and stuff uh, what they need to do. And it goes wrong and he ends up in one where he shouldn't be and there's Arnold Schwarzenegger in there and they try and escape together or something. I can't remember what it's called. I also don't think it was terribly good. You don't know much about films or shows? This, this is something I'd never heard of and I just randomly uh, turned it on one night and watched about half of it. I didn't see the end. It was... Didn't seem very good, so. 
You've heard of that too? Escape plan. I think that's it, Vastorant. Thanks. I think that sounds like the one. Yeah, it's like an interesting concept. Don't think it'd be a very good job to have, but... Um, no, the, the film sort of went downhill after a bit. Right, what am I looking for down here? So we found the sunken elven ruins. And there's loads of elven ruins over here. We'll try some of these before I sail in. Hornworth. Aha. This ain't it, but I mean, this is like free loot. I must try not to drown here. The game is trying its best to glitch like mad. Where else did it do it? It was in one of the shops, I think. In the city? Where the shop didn't have a back wall to it. But then I couldn't get out either. That kind of went wrong. Okay, going down again. What's this we've got? Cash. It's quite nice diving for stuff. It's a shame there isn't like a diving suit or something that you can pick up. That would be fun. Oh, don't, don't get stuck. Oh, no. 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 It won't let me swim through that. Right. Let's get out of there at least. Leaving the big door exploration last. Yes, because I've been in there before. And there's nothing that says it has to be in the big door. <laughs> it's not the big door. There's some stuff down there. Uh, I think I should have had a killer whale potion. There it is. This is gonna. This is gonna be quite some. Oh, it's okay. I can go up there. That's fine. Loot everything quick, quick. Get it. What more can I pick up? Hit the A button as fast as it will go. Come on, come on, come on. No armor dies. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff. Swim, swim. I hope there's some air at the top of this. I'm getting. I'm getting stuck. <laughs> That was a little bit close. Why not? I've been in here before, haven't I? Thought I had. Come on, down you go. Just pick everything up and then we'll swim out. Is this not the... No, it's not the same ruins I was thinking of, maybe. It looked very familiar. You were here but didn't loot? Is this really mad? I wonder if I was in a rush for something. It's not like me to leave good loot behind. Unless I got caught on some rocks. And I couldn't get out. And I'll start to panic. Um, uh, help. Damn, this is tight. Geralt's going to be a champion swimmer after this. He'll hold his breath for hours. Right, we've got the stuff. We need to think of a plan to go for next. Uh, I could go to Beauclair Point. I'm so close to this stuff. I feel like I should probably finish these off. And some Grandmaster gear, so let's, let's go and do these. Ignoring those things on the shore. Hey, Hamas, is that the back altar or back later? Where are we going? Let's get uh, some horsepower. By the way, I just remembered I've got hold of a copy of a new game. It's in, I think it's still in early access. It's called Forged of Blood. Uh, the developer sent me a copy for review. It's like 
It's like XCOM meets fantasy RPG, if that makes sense. From what I've... I haven't loaded up to test it out yet. But from what I can tell, that's the sort of... That's the premise of the game. Run, run. Anyone heard of it? Anyone interested in watching it if I decide to stream it for a bit? Not I'm sure when I'll stream it, but uh, it's, it's on the cards for some time. This is not where I wanted to end up. Hey yeah. Explore the map and do all the other stuff. Story missions can suck you in, completing on, multiple Roach. quests in a row without realizing. Well, that's true. What have I found here? Take it easy. Are these? All well, these aren't bad guys. Oh, there, sir. I guess those swords on your back aren't there as festoons. Maybe you could help me. Maybe. Depends. Well, there's a cave that, to my mind, would be splendid for aging wine. Not over dry, and none too moist. But? Well, damn thing's full of noise. The arse-clenching sort. <laughs> Clinkety, bangity, knockety kind. Sent my clerk in to see, been two days. And he's not back. He ain't I coming it's back. I to do with the elven ruins. Blah. That about the cave. So, lend us a hand, will you? Hey, let's talk about some reward. I need some cash for this. Could help, provided you can pay. Let's go, because sometimes you can ask for, like, ridiculous amounts. Mm, yes, we're almost there. And other times, not so much. I've not got my head around this, uh, this system. At all. Fine. I'll have a look in the cave, see what lurks there. Ah! Well, while we're here... Vintner's Places. It's a nice looking cave. That's a pool, right? We don't need to re... Or is that somewhere we could swim down? I don't think it is. That looks... Slightly broken. There's a gargoyle. There's the body of something. Is this the Clark? I think we've found what killed him. Uh, Elementa. And don't think any of the other ones are much good against these guys. So. Ah, I didn't dodge that very well at all. Oh, that one. Let's just get some regen going. <laughs> Ow. Nasty gargoyle hit me. I know, those ass-clenching noises. <laughs> mushrooms. I've looted so many of those damn mushrooms. Tucson Knight's Trousers. Is that it? Kill the monsters. Right, so there's more. Oh, did I miss? No, I must have looted that. Why can I not see any more? Oh, I see, I see. Behind Joe. This guy's green. Ouch. Fitness contract, cleaning those hard to reach places. Well, that was quick and simple. Is it worth having an explore in the... Uh, do I want to go swimming? Uh, I guess so. Loot. You see? Loot. I can't leave the loot alone. I can't swim. Alright, screw that. This must be easier with a mouse and keyboard. What the hell's witch sensors? I can't. That does feel a bit easier. Is that rise? Okay, how do you get Witcher sensors on? That's acrobatics, not swimming. I can't see where I'm... I need this back. It's definitely easy to control the direction with a, with a mouse and keyboard underwater. 
I just maybe should have looked at the, what the key bindings were. Is it only right mouse click? I thought that would have been block. Not that you can block underwater, so yeah, that would make sense. Oh, what the hell is all this? Ah, uh, disappointing. Still, I found loads of like this. So I'm hoping there's going to be a good need for all this crafting at some point. You might be remembering right. Can I? Yeah, that looks like it does it. Yeah, cheers. It's for dyes, the silver and stuff. Uh, oh, missed that one. Copper. So, uh, wait, 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 wait. I've missed this as well. Or is this just a quick way out? Uh, okay. That's why that puddle was there. Right, hey, Jeff. See, oh, you this? Done. Done. Jeff, we've done it. Done. All clear now. Did you manage it? Yeah, all taken care of. <laughs> and four call witches lay about some freeloaders. Bollocks. Who calls me that? Storehouse I'll be having will be ready in two days at most. And here on in, you've cut rate prices on all my goods. Good. Not from around here, are you? Nay, from Povis we are. Wandered <laughs> south for the climb before the first war. Chills up north were giving me wifey lumbago. I like this guy's accent. He's a proper northerner. Also, make the Knights for Hire quest active. There's a lot of those out there. What you got on offer? Wouldn't mind a glance. Wine and cheese. Can I offload a load of rubbish? Oh, well, yes, I can, actually. Mutated Giant Centipede album. I think I might need some of that stuff, but... Broken Meteorite Pickaxe. Sell it, sell it. Whatever the hell that is, sell the books. I mean, blunt pickaxes. Why am I carrying this stuff? I pick it up by accident because I'm in too much of a rush. Flowers, that, that. The hell? An old map of Tucson? Sell it. Actually, that might have... Would that go on my wall somewhere if I keep that? We'll try. Okay, where was I going? I was going to do... something. So long. You recommend dismantling green gold stuff? I'll wait till there's uh, some sort of need for it, I think. And then I get a better idea of what I need to dismantle or not. So that's worth going for. Should we go straight in for that? Go we'll straight for that one. Back to me, horse. Empty dead. Sweep up here. Botch it all. So we've now got a wine merchant we can visit. Like everywhere sells wine in this place. I mean, it is truly French. But I mean, why would I need to go to a wine merchant if there's any particular reason? Ugly bastard. What? Is Geralt talking about me, or is he talking about the thing we just rode past? I might just ride back, I want to see what it is. He obviously felt pretty strongly about it. Oh, it's just a bear. It's barely worth my time. This, however, looks more interesting. What's this place? Is there a quick way up? Oh god, there's like... It's, it's like crawling with crap up here. Now that's a proper Superman climb. Where are we going then? 